We're lucky, um, we, we live in a lovely part of the world here in Lismore, in the Blackwater Valley. It's very good land for, for farming and for breeding horses. We're lucky to be continuing the tradition. You know, my parents set up this farm, um, the stud side of this farm, 50 years ago now. Um, and uh, they've been standing stallions here in partnership with the Magnar family for the last 50 years. Soldier of Fortune um, was a top class racehorse. He won two group ones, won the Irish Derby by nine lengths. And uh, he's breeding some really good looking stock now. They're great walkers and uh, they sell very well in the sales. And he's sired grade one winners on the flat and over, over jumps. So uh, we're really excited about his stock now for the future. I think he's going to be a very good sire. He's uh, a son of the world's greatest sire, Galileo, and uh, he, he, he's breeding really good looking stock and they can all walk and they look like they can run too. Very excited to have Crystal Ocean standing at the beaches. He's stepped right into Flemingsford's boots. He's, uh, he was the highest rated horse in the world when he retired to stud. and. Uh, he was rated 133 by Time Farm. He see the stars, best son. He ran 17 times and he was never out of the first three, winning seven group races. Very well received by breeders. He covered a big book of mares in his first season, uh, including grade one winners and dams of grade one winners. Wings of Eagles is a really good looking horse. An Epsom Derby winner. It's very unusual to have an Epsom Derby winner covering national hunt mares, so uh, we're very lucky to have him. He's from the Manchu line, which is proven for National Hunt. And uh, he is getting very good looking foals, so uh, we're very excited about this horse. Great walker and uh, powerfully built horse. He won a very good Epsom Derby, beat several Group 1 winners in the race, including Cracksman. So it was a very good Derby that he, that he won. Idaho is a very well-bred horse. He's a full brother to two. Group 1 winners, seven time Group 1 winner Highland Reel, and also Cape of Good Hope, who's Group 1 winner. And Idaho was a very high class racehorse in his own right. He uh, very sound and consistent and genuine. He raced at Group 1 level at two, three, four, and five years of age. And uh, he was placed in two derbies, won the Harwick Stakes, Royal Ascot. So uh, we're very excited about that horse. He's got a great temperament, he's, he's a great walker and uh, like all the Galileos he's got a great temperament and that really stands to, to horses I think. Covango is a son of Monson, very good looking horse. Um, Monson has proved to be a great outcross for uh, the uh, Saddle as well's line and uh, he's, uh, the, Monson is sire of Network, Getaway, Maxius. So, um, he, uh, he, he's very, very important to have an outcross, um, you know, in the yard, and uh, he's providing very good outcross. He's started off very well from his first crop of four-year-olds. He's bred some really nice winners, Langer, Dan, Percy Warner, and Glenn Glass, to name it, but a few. Mahler is a, a very successful sire. He was a good racehorse. He was a Royal Ascot winner, third in the Melbourne Cup, and uh, he's, um, breeds plenty of winners, really good. They're good lookers, they win plenty of races. He's bred a um, very good grade one winner in Ornua. He's bred Sutton Place, and his best horse at the moment is Chris's Dream. Flemingsworth is still hale and hearty. He's retired now, but he covered 22 full seasons here, and uh, he was champion sire twice in the last three seasons. Red Gold Cup winner, Imperial Commander, Tidal Bay, Flemish Star, a host of top class horses. He bred a Relegate, who was bred here on the farm. She won the champion bumper at Cheltenham. She's out of her own mare, last of the bunch. He also bred Total Enjoyment, another filly who won the um, champion bumper at Cheltenham. He bred a Royal Ascot winner in Jenny's Jewel. He's been a tremendous sire. The Irish breeders are, are the backbone of, of, of Irish ra racing. Um, Many, many of our, our, our uh, customers here are farmers. It's been a great tradition, especially in this part of the world here in the Blackwater Valley um, for, for breeding national hunt horses.